Okay, welcome back. Playthrough of Dragon Age Origins. Uh, we're back in the Earl of Denerim, um, Earl Eamon's estate in Denerim. Uh, having finished uh, finding up some dirt on Loghain, talking to those nobles before, uh, we're going to go and report our findings to the Earl to see what our next step is. Ah, there you are. I was about to send out a search party. Hmm. I've been hearing of a great commotion in the alienage. What exactly happened there? Uh, Logan was collaborating with a Deventer slaver. Make her forgive me. I should be appalled that such a thing could exist here. But I'm overjoyed you can implicate Logan. We must end the civil war quickly. What the blight does not corrupt in this land, politics surely will. Yes. The last of our allies have arrived in the city. We cannot delay any longer. I will call for the landsmen to convene. Bring Alistair and join me at the palace as soon as you are ready, Warden. So, just like that, we're going to go to the Lensmeet. Alistair? I hope Eamon doesn't expect me to give a speech. Maker, he probably does, doesn't he? Oh. Fun. Okay. So, uh, before we do that, though, there's a couple of things around uh, the market we want to finish up doing. Um, so to take Indeed. Alistair and win. Yes. Oh, you had to take Alistair, so. Unless it goes right to it. It might actually just go right straight to it, so we may not. Uh... Oh, okay. We get to do stuff. Uh, first and foremost, we want to find. Um, when we talk to Riordan, when we freed him, he crap. talked about uh, Grey Warden. Crap. Armory, cache, what have you. So we're gonna go and visit that first. That's uh, back in here. Loading. Which I believe is back here. Secret panel. So there's a bunch of stuff in here to loot. So I take the armor. And like I said, we're getting towards the end. You know, there's the lands meet, and then there's the, you know, and then like the end game where you're going after the, the dark spawn. So we're getting fairly near the end here. Um, and so speaking, you know, I have most of my people outfitted with what weapons and armor I need of them or want of them. The rest of this, rest of this loot, really. Um, doesn't really serve to need much. I mean, you not speak well, but we did pick up. Oh, what's this? Spirit Ward plus 10 spirit resistance. Yeah. Uh, there was a few more uh, gifts, one being Duncan Shield. We're going to give that to Alistair as a gift. Oh, this, this shield. It's Duncan's, isn't he, it? He always whined about wanting Jesus something Christ. of him. Thank you. Truly, I had no idea his shield wasn't with him. This is perfect. I, I don't know how else to express my gratitude. This means a great deal to me. I can't believe you remembered it at all. Uh, of course I remember it. I'll treasure this. Thank you. You're welcome. Let's see here. Is it a better shield than what he has? Or is he wearing it already? He's wearing it already. Uh, six was twelve defense, three willpower, and stamina regeneration. Versus ten defense and less stamina, but uh, we're gonna give it to him. It's it's a better defense. It's less, well, it's more fatigue, but it has greater missile deflection. Uh, and it is silverite versus steel, so I guess that would help. Um, yeah, we'll leave it. It means more to him. Than Eamon's. Maybe I should give Eamon's back to Eamon, but. Griffin Helm. Uh, no. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, let's go. We are going to go back the way we came. And there's still that last um, thieving quest from. What's his name? Over here? The redhead. Dwarven crafts. Fine dwarven we can crafts. do that. 
Slim. Good to see you, Warden. Fighting the good fight, eh? Uh, yeah, that's it. Mark, I think I did all the marks. There's no way you can top that last heist wolf. Yeah. You're a legend. The nobles okay. are still afraid to come out of their manners. Hooray! I have one last job. A legendary one. Oh, <laughs> a paltry ten sovereigns is my take. Okay, sure. At this point, I... It's, they're falling out of my pockets anyway. Dan Frandaril is one of the richest men in the entire kingdom. At his grand ball next week, he's displaying some of his priceless treasures. Paintings of old masters, the armaments of the first king of Denerim, and more. Oh, more. Mages have put up magical wards, but I've got a route that will bypass that. Once inside, I've no idea how you'll deal with the guards, but if you do, you'll be rich and infamous. I can't wait to see what people say. Okay, so. One last break in. Uh, looks like it's over here. This one is the Royal Palace. Oh, that's land meet. We don't want to go there just yet. Let's do this quick burglary before we <laughs> make King uh, Alistair his, a king. Uh, let's see what's in here. Well, I unlocked right. it, and there's like a lever, but I don't think the lever actually does anything. So I'll go in there and take stuff. No big riches yet, though, so let's take a look around and see if we can find it. I have barricaded, so I can't go that way. So we go back around this way into the store. Hmm. Suspiciously uh, empty of things. One store. Again, empty of loot and or people. Guards, this is not a good sign. Quest update. Uh, let's see here. Frendel's estate was almost deserted and it was easy getting to the treasure room. Too easy by far. It turns out the whole thing was a trap. So now we'll have to fight our way back. He set me up, or he was duped, more likely. So now we have to fight our way up. Which is okay by me. I'm quite good at that. Okay, let's see here. Uh, ooh, they're going after Win. Ooh, that's stealth. I don't do that nearly enough. Excuse me. This guy. By the time I get around him, okay. That's fine. I don't know what I should do. I should uh, take over win. And uh, I shall do so. Come on, move. See if we can get a fireball in here. And it looks like they spread out. Oh well, we'll just do a fireball over here. Right ahead. Trap. Did that fireball hit anyone? I don't know that it did. Repulsed. Stun you. Ha ha. Gleefully. Gleefully. Oh, Alistair, you walked right into it. More importantly, you deprived me of my XP. That's here. You know, I gotta look at Liliana's tactics. She drinks an awful lot of potions. So I'm wondering if her health... Enemy health at negative 10%? Okay, that's that's not right. <laughs> I thought that she was drinking an awful lot of potions. Okay, self-health minus 10%. Use health pulses. <laughs> uh, well, let's give her a thing for her mark of death. So we'll make it... Um, enemy rank... 
Uh, a leader higher. We'll give it a uh, mark of death. There we go. Save that. <laughs> Thought it's, it just it seemed to, you know, I, I play and I see her down a health potion. It's like, was she, was she hurt? What? Then, then again, it's here, down it again. I don't know, maybe, maybe you know, your viewers saw that happen more often than not, but uh, it, just, it just seemed kind of odd. Okay, let's go stealth. Let's go to... Ooh, fireball. Our post. Gotta go after the mages. They are the most dangerous. Thank you, Alistair, for the holy smite. Soldier. And there. Okay, let's leave. Just. I yeah, think about how long ago I set those uh, tactics for Liliana. Lil Liliana? Let's go back to the market district and and yell at Slim Baldry. Say, hey, that was a trap. As there is but one world, one life. I can't believe Ban Frandero fooled me. His guards almost nabbed you. I feel like a bloody fool, I do. Listen, I have to go. Here's your coin back. I won't take a silver because of the way that went down. Well, Give me some time. Yeah, I think you owe me something. We get our revenge. We will. Okay, so he disappears. Um, so now let's go to the lands meet. That out of the way. So there's a royal palace as opposed to the Fort Draken. Wonder why they're not in the same place. Warden, I am not surprised it has come to this. Let's see if I can and persuade Alice, her. If you were even remotely worthy of being called Marek's son, you would already be in the land's meet. Now wouldn't you? You have torn Ferelden apart to oppose the very man who ensured you were born into freedom. But do not think you will get past me to desecrate the land's meet itself. The nobles of Ferelden will confirm my lord as regent, and we can finally put this to rest once you are gone. Uh, let's use my persuade. Say, hey, can't you see what a monster he has become? I have had so many doubts of late. See? Logan is a great man, but his hatred of Orle has driven him to madness. He has done terrible things. I know it, but I owe him everything. I cannot betray him. Do not ask me to. Then let me stop him. You know it's the only way. That sounds a little bit like Vader. I never thought duty would taste so bitter. Stop him, Warden. Stop him from betraying everything he once loved. Please, show mercy. Without Logan, there would be no Ferelden to defend. So yeah, you could talk to her like that, or you could fight her. Uh. Oops, someone leveled. A big show. My lords and ladies of the Landsmeet, Tian Logain would have us give up our freedoms, our traditions, out of fear. He placed us on this path, yet we should place our destiny in his hands? Must we sacrifice everything good about our nation to save it? Yay. A fine performance, Eamon. <laughs> But no one here is taken in by it. You would attempt to put a puppet on the throne, and every soul here knows it. The better question is who will pull the strings. Ah! Here we have the puppeteer. Ah. Okay. Tell us, Warden. How will the Orlesians take our nation from us? Will they deign to send their troops, or simply issue their commands through this would-be prince? What do they offer you? How much is the price of Ferelden honor now? Uh, let's see here. Uh, the blight is the threat here. Not Orle. 
There are enough refugees in my Banorn now to make that abundantly clear. The South has fallen, Loghain. Will you let Darkspawn take the whole country for fear of Orlay? The Blight is indeed real, Wolf. But do we need Grey Wardens to fight it? They claim that they alone can end the Blight, yet they failed spectacularly against the Darkspawn at Ostagar. And they asked to bring with them four legions of Chevaliers. And once we open our borders to the Chevaliers, and we really expect them to simply return from whence they came. Yes. Uh, let's see here. We'll do the torture one first. The Warden speaks truly. My son was taken under cover of night. The things done to him. Some of them are beyond any healer's skill. How was responsible for himself. He will answer to the Maker for any wrongs committed in this life, as must we all. But you know that. You were the one who murdered him. Whatever Howe may have done, he should have been brought before the Seneschal. There is no justice in butchering a man in his home. Uh, let's see here. Um... Let's do the one about selling elves to Zivinter. Selling elves? Explain this, Loghain. This is war. Did you believe it would be like the old tales? Knights with pennants flying over battlefields where all outcomes are decided simply and with honor. War is cruel. Every soul who fought alongside Marek knows this. And in it, there are no such things as innocence, only the living and the dead, and the degrees of guilt both bear. Sacrifices were made. If they were too great, the Maker will judge me for it. But enough of this. I have a question for you, Warden. What have you done with my daughter? Uh, let's see here. I've protected her from you. You took my daughter, our queen, by force, killing her guards in the process. What arts have you employed to keep her? Does she even still live? I believe I can speak for myself. Yes, there she is. Lords and ladies of Ferelden, hear me. My father is no longer the man you know. This man is not the hero of Riverdale. This man turned his troops aside and refused to protect your king as he fought bravely against the Darkspawn. This man seized Kaelin's throne before his body was cold and locked me away so I could not reveal his treachery. I would have already been killed, if not for this Grey Warden. Yay, uh, yes. So, the Warden's influence has poisoned even your mind, Enora. I want to protect you. crazy. Crazy man. My lords and ladies, our land has been threatened before. It's been invaded and lost and won times beyond counting. We Ferelden's have proven that we will never truly be conquered so long as we are united. We must not let ourselves be divided now. Stand with me and we shall defeat even the Blight itself! Southreach stands with the Grey Wardens. The Warden helped me personally in a family matter. Waking Sea stands with the Grey Warden. Dragon's Peak supports the Warden. The Western Hills throw their lot in with the Wardens. Make her help us. I stand by Loghain. We've no hope of victory otherwise. I stand with the Warden. The blight is coming. See, all we these people the standing wardens. for you only happen if you do all those side quests. I think like the first few times I didn't do all those, and so um, they went against me and I had to fight the entire room. Uh, but this time... Traitors! Which of you stood against the Orlesian Emperor when his troops flattened your fields and raped your wives? You fought with us once, Eamon! You cared about this land once, before you got too old and fat and content to even see what you risk. None of you deserve a say in what happens here. None of you have spilled blood for this land the way I have. How dare you judge me? Uh, let's see, call off your man and we'll settle this honorably. So it's like, 
We get to have a duel. Then, let us end this. I suppose we both knew it would come to this. When we first met at Ostagar, I would never have thought so, but Ostagar seems like it happened in another lifetime to someone else. It's like 30 hours ago. Man is made by the quality of his enemies. Marek told me that once. I wonder if it's more a compliment to you or me. You, I Enough. think, because I am awesome. Let the landsmeet declare the terms of the duel. It shall be fought according to tradition. A test of arms in single combat until one party yields. And we who are assembled will abide by the outcome. Will you face me yourself, or have you a champion? Uh, I will be myself. It is you or me the men will follow. So, let us fight for it. Prepare yourself. Okay. Gets a little dramatic. Thunderous music, boom. Actually, I kind of like this. This is a nice little bit of choreography. They stand, you know, and they do a little half circle here. A little twisty twist. Can I go stealth? Will it work? Let's see. Aha! It did work. I'll go over here. Okay. We'll uh, mark of death him. Oop, I think that may be uh, visible, so... We'll repost him. Yeah, this is easy peasy. <laughs> I don't think it's been ever quite this easy, but yeah, it works. Simple. I underestimated you, Warden. By a lot, yes. I thought you were like Kalen, a child wanting to play at war. I was wrong. There's a strength in you that I have not seen anywhere since Marek died. I yield. You will die for what you've done. Wait, there is another option. What? The Tairn is a warrior and general of renown. Let him be of use. Let him go through the joining. You want him to make him a warden? There are three of us in all of Ferelden. And there are... Compelling reasons to have as many wardens on hand as possible to deal with the Archdemon. The joining itself is often fatal, is it not? If he survives, you gain a general. If not, you have your revenge. Doesn't that satisfy you? Absolutely not! Riordan, this man abandoned our brothers and then blamed us for the deed. He hunted us down like animals. He tortured you! How can we simply forget that? No, he's gonna die for his crimes. You can't do this. My father may have been wrong, but he is still a hero to the people. Honora, hush. It's over. Stop treating me like a child. This is serious. Daughters never grow up, Honora. They remain six years old with pigtails and skinned knees forever. Father. Just make it quick, Warden. I can face the Maker knowing that Ferelden is in your hands. Very well. Yeah, there's all kinds of choices you could make here. Uh, you can make him a warden, but then Alistair goes away. Um, becomes a drunkard. I think he would show up. As okay. I could have like, had him kneel first or something. Oh well. That guy did crimes against uh, the country? So it is decided. Alistair will take his father's throne. Wait, what? No! When did this get decided? Nobody's decided that. That doesn't make any sense. So much for our plan to rule together. If Alistair would rather not have the throne, I am more than willing to take it. I hardly think you're the appropriate person to mediate this, Sonora. Warden, will you help us? Oh, bloody hell. Yeah, that's, uh... I could sell this. As the arbiter of this dispute, what is your decision? Who will lead for Elden? You know, I, I have never taken, um... Oh, I suppose there's, the option isn't here. Usually... <coughs> so, <coughs> oh, excuse me. Sometimes there's an option where, you know, the, the warden takes it. I never took that, but, um... We'll do this one. 
We do. I believe this is what King Merrick wanted. To see his blood tied to my father's to begin a new line of Ferelden kings. But I... I mean... I, I did swear a no. What I mean is, I'm, I'm all for founding a new line of kings. But... Well, there's the blight. What the king is trying to say, my lords and ladies, is that he will be taking the field with his fellow Grey Warden to do battle with the Archdemon. Uh, yes. That. Until then, I shall stay in Denerim and rule in my husband's absence, as I did for Caelan. But I trust Alistair shall reach a more heroic ending. My fellow Grey Warden will, I hope, take Loghain's place as the leader of my armies. Shall we finish this thing together? Uh, yes. We will be displayed as Caelan dreamed. Everyone, get ready to march! It's going to take all of Ferelden's strength to survive this blight. But we will face it, and we'll defeat it! Ferelden is depending on you all. Okay. You made me king. After all this is over with, they're actually going to put me on the throne. Yes. I'm still... I'm going to be the king. And here I thought you'd be. Uh, is that a thank you? Thank you? You want me to thank you? How could you do this to me? I've done nothing but regret my blood since the day I was born. I don't want this. I never wanted this. I hate the very idea of it. I thought we were friends. You knew how I felt about this, yet you went ahead and did it anyway. Why? Uh, we're friends. This is a good thing. I guess I'll take that one. I'll do the country thing. Which one do I want to choose? And what I want doesn't factor in anywhere, does it? Funny how it always works out like that. I've just never thought of myself as a leader. I'm going to make a terrible king, you have to know that. How can I make decisions that are going to affect the lives of everyone in the kingdom? I guess I don't really have a choice in this now, do I? I'll do my best, of course, and I expect that you'll be there to help me, right? Uh... There. You're the one who got me into this mess. And besides, where else would you go? We're a team. Well, that option isn't really open to me anymore, is it? I'm going to be king whether I like it or not. Grey Warden or no. And if I can be an exception, then so can you. As a matter of fact, I insist. That's good enough for me. Arl Eamon has left for Redcliffe. He says the army has gathered there and is almost ready to march. As soon as we're ready, we should head to Redcliffe ourselves. The blight awaits, right? That's strange. He's supposed to be a bit more, um, I want this kind of attitude. It's hardening, so to speak, unless I picked the wrong thing for that before. I don't know. Um, let's see. Actually, this is like one of the rare instances of my playthroughs where I don't romance him, so, uh, maybe it's different. Uh, let's see, dexterity, cunning, and constitution. And, uh, let's see, what do I want? Uh, what's feign death? No, I don't want feign death. Uh, I guess I can go in the duelist? Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, wait, I've still got, i still got points? Hang on. Oh, I had two points here. Okay, uh... No. Oh, I could have gotten Whirlwind. We'll go towards Whirlwind. Play. Put this over here. Put this over here. Okay, now we're all leveled. Uh, this is probably one of the better places to stop the video. 
uh, because I'll have to go to work soon. And uh, I think the next bit will be the like the end game because we're uh, ready to march on to the yeah. I think we're about ready. Uh, so I thank you for watching. Uh, thank you for your time. Uh, I will see you next time. Bye bye.